is the entry to my patio for our new home. And I'm taping to share what it looks like before we start to decorate. We just moved in over the long holiday weekend. So this is the patio. Uh, there's our old patio furniture that has to be painted. My son's bike. Um, there's the patio door that goes to the downstairs. Um, so there's that view. Then we come into the house. And there's all the crazy packing mess and my dog. There is nothing but boxes, uh, yeah, boxes and boxes as far as the eye can see. <sighs> so much work to be done. But anyway, this is the downstairs. This part will be just kind of like a little lounge. Um, my husband works from home. He's a photographer, so this will really be like his office space. And a bunch of the stuff over there is photography equipment behind toys. Um, this place was built in the 60s, so it has, I don't think it was actually renovated, it's a three-story townhouse. So there are the old cabinets. I think downstairs was probably like the adult wet bar area. Uh, gives us plenty of storage space down here. Um, then we have this little nook that I don't know what we'll do with. Um, this door, sorry about the lighting, goes into the bathroom that we have decided is going to be the master. Um, so camera, my hair's not done so you can't see me today. Uh, tub, shower, then another door that goes into what will be our master bedroom. Oh, this is probably good. good. It's messy right now but uh, we, there's our bed. Um, there is a faux window there. If you actually go over there, that's not a window because this is kind of the basement level. So you look out into really dirt. Um, let's see if I can find a light. So you come in. Um, there's our chest of drawers. We really like mid-century furniture. Uh, and then we have a walk-in closet. It's not huge. Oh, sorry, you can't see anything. Um, there you go. Walk-in closet, which is not organized yet. Like I said, we've been here, I don't know, two full days. But it will be. I have intentions to make it really nice. And I will share those videos and things with you. Okay, so that's the bedroom. Um... We need stuff, so you'll get to see us getting stuff. So then here's the other door, not through the bathroom. Here's our cat, who's telling me he's hungry. Hey, come on, come on. So here's the stairs on the first floor. Oh my god, I'm in so much better shape just from moving for the last couple days. Move cat! Um, because it's three stories and we've been going up and down stairs. It's crazy. So this is the half bath. Kind of the guest bath. Um, so it's not a bad size. And it's got all the storage that I don't even know what I'm going to do with. Right now, just toilet paper. Um, this is a view from that. So, going this way, this is the living room. Um, there's a little niche, which is going to house my desk. And that'll be my YouTube area. Um, let me get a light. Okay, there we go. So, there's my desk and a toy for his children. Um, then this is the front door that we'll probably never use because the parking is in the back by the patio. Um, there's a coat closet. Um, living room's pretty big. Here's my girl and my dog. We want to get a sectional to put in here. 
and then you go this way and this is the dining room right now we're using the table that was in our old house which was like one third of the size of this one um, but we will get uh, an actual dining room table and more chairs there's more mid-century stuff I'm going to recover those chairs um, here's our console credenza that I love and where those things are I'm going to put a coffee station and more artwork of course I'm testing that out to see if I want it there so you turn this way and there's the kitchen which is a decent size um, I guess has enough storage for us um, the cabinets are this weird color I don't know if you can see and that's not a cabinet yeah uh, so we'll probably paint them I don't know but those are the cabinets um, the kitchen is really the only thing that's been sort of organized so cups and diningware what are we having for dinner? Uh, you hear my boy you might not want to come what? you might not want to come what? YouTubing oh. um, this is the laundry room which is in the kitchen wait, wait, don't, don't. what's for dinner? I don't know yet <laughs> There's a Damn, child. I'm throw this away. Hold on. Here's the pantry, which is really awkward. So what I could no, use is some. Okay. Stop. I could use some ideas on this pantry, guys. Because yes, it's really weird. See, it's like Check this out big my long space. Wheezy. Excuse him. It's a big long space, not enough shelves exactly. So it's not an efficient way to store anything. Um, there's another one up here. I still have all my seasonings in a box. Um, then that stuff. So, I'm going to need a good way to organize that. I haven't figured it out yet. Um, so, that's the second floor, which is basically the living floor. Then we're going up more stairs. And one more flight of stairs. And this is the upstairs. Um, so this is basically my youngest son's bathroom. Because we've got three full baths here, okay. so we don't have to share. Uh, this is horrible, you can't see anything, sorry. Um, so toilet, bathroom. Uh, this is my daughter's room, which I guess it's supposed to be the formal master, but we decided this is her first chance to have a nice huge room to herself, and she is going to be 16 this year. Wow. So she got this one. So it's got a little patio that looks out into some trees. It's kind of narrow, but it's probably big enough for a chair and a little table. Um, nice big wall. There's her bed on the floor right now. So she'll get a bigger bed. There she is. Um, her room, her old room, used to be pretty much the space of what you're seeing right now. That was it. Her new room is probably three times as big. Um, oh yeah, she wants to show off her closet. So, hold on, light. Okay, so there's her closet. She's actually got it really nicely organized. It's also a walk-in. So she's got books and things up there. Um, her music stuff, she loves music. So she's got a guitar and a keyboard. And then basketball gold because she loves that. Her clothes are nicely organized and her shoes. I'm so impressed. I'm going to have to get her to do my stuff. And then she's got this vanity that she will probably use as a desk and then she has a bathroom inside of her room and again nice size there's the mirror um, the vanities are older but they were in good shape um, and they're tall 
compared to what I'm used to anyway. So, tub, shower, kind of standard. So that's her room. Say goodbye, Katie. Bye, humans. And then you go straight. So this room with the closed door belongs to the youngest. I'm not going to take you in there because he's in there doing stuff. Um, this room is our extra. It's our fourth room. And we're using it as a rec room. So there's all the trophies for martial arts, championships, uh, the gaming, television, chair that we need to recover because they don't want to give it up. Futon that we actually found, but it was in great condition, so we're going to keep it. Um, and then it has like these kind of closet, and then more boxes that need to be picked up or put away. So it's not like a huge room, but it's got good light, and it's perfect for just an extra space. You know, the futon will fold out so we can have guests. But the kids can go in there and play. So that's it. That's all three stories. Um, I plan on videotaping as I make changes and figure out how I'm going to decorate it um, as I work on projects. I just thought this was a good chance to start vlogging about it. And my mommy wanted to have a tour of the space. So. Hi, Mommy. Here's your chance to see where we live. My mom is several states away. I'm in Georgia. She's in Louisiana. So here's her chance to see the place, too. And you guys, like, subscribe, and just, you know, let me know what you think. If you have suggestions on uh, that whole awkward pantry thing and, I don't know, anything else tips for unpacking boxes in an efficient way. I can't spend the whole day because I'm at work all day. Um, so right now I just plan on doing like two or three boxes a night for the rest of the week and hopefully I'll be done soon. Um, the only other awkward thing, this window is going to need window curtain, you know, curtains of some type. I'm not sure what I'm going to do. Um, anyway, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, leave me a comment. Uh, tell me about your latest moving, whenever you moved last. What was your moving horror? My moving horror was that I managed to wreck my car pulling out to go get boxes from the old house. So that was a huge horror, but it wasn't the end of the world. So that's it. So tell me what your moving horror is. All right. Bye.